Hi guys and welcome to my newest video. Today I bring you a very cool video actually. Um, I decided to do a poll on Instagram and wanted to show you some of my things, my precious things in my room, things I collect. And the first thing is that I do have bookshelves here and I also have my makeup collection here. So I decided today to show you my makeup collection that was the one that had that had the most votes even though it was like bookshelf and um, makeup collection so I was like okay you guys decided in the end you decided the makeup collection so as you can see here I have brushes in and on top of it and yeah I'm going to show you a little bit of what I have in each drawer as well this is the Alexa 9 drawer Alex Alex drawers <laughs> not Alexa Alex drawers from Ikea these probably you have seen them these are very popular to store makeup and all that jazz so I'm going to go and show you what's inside each drawer and show you a little bit of what I have from the brushes and the brushes I have so here is the top of my Alex drawers then we will continue to show what's on the other drawers but for now let's start with this so here I have all of my face brushes this acrylic drawer is from Marshalls so I store them there I also got some other face um, products you would say that from the jade roller some eyelash curlers uh, some beauty blenders real techniques and beauty blender as well um sponges makeup sponges and here i got all of my lip liners um i do have more nudes because they are amazing from a little bit of everything from nyx to kkw beauty i also got from alamar cosmetics which i really like this one is the birthday suit liner which is one of my favorites currently and here i got all of my eye brushes this one is this holder is from a friend she gave it to me in another job i had <laughs> so i'm really thankful for, thankful for that oh my god i can't speak today so here i got all of my eye brushes they are pretty dirty i need to wash them and i also got some face or eye brushes for conceal for concealer or for anything else that i want to you know use I also have here a tiny um, chair pop, a Sephora and Chanel bag over there. I got my toner over here, which is the Kiehl's Rare Earth Pore Refining um, Toner, and then <laughs> some acetone over here. This is the thing that I use to clean my brushes, but I think I will get rid of it because it's a little bit dirty already. It has passed quite a while since I owned that, so I pretty much need a to, re to restock something to clean my brushes also got this tiny star lamp i really like it it's so pretty i got it from marshall's recently i think it was like seven dollars or something like that and then here i have my recent purchase um this is from the hocus pocus collection from ColourPop. i do i am waiting for the eyeshadow palettes they haven't come yet but i do have the lip duo that came first it's so cute i love it i'm here ready to use it for a video next time so i'm waiting for the palette and then i'm gonna use this okay so let's start with my first drawer this is the skincare drawer it's a little bit messy i don't have a divider for this yet but you know we're gonna get there but i do throw a little bit of everything on here i do have these glossier pink pouches which they come with their you know with the purchases i make and this is perfect to store to take to travel and all of that jazz so i really like them and also store them here i do have a little bit of everything it's a mess so excuse that but yeah i do have a little bit of kiehl's products over here i do have eye products over here samples um the ordinary mask over here i store some masks here but i do also store things on the fridge so yeah, I do have another glossy pouch with all of that that I store there. I do have some hair products here from Olaplex. Some amazing products from Good Molecules as well. This cleansing balm is life. This one is empty. I actually should get rid of that because I do have a big um, size from that. Uh, I have Tatcha products as well. I love this. 
This is also empty, but I think I want to recycle. <laughs> um, it's one of my favorite moisturizers of all time. This is the water cream. And it's already finished, but I do like using it to maybe put something in the future there to store. Maybe jewelry something. I do have their lip mask, which is so good. This is a Kisu lip mask. And also some products I haven't used, like this Dr. Tuna Tea Tree face wash. It's there because I, I think it was a sample that someone gave me. I mean, products that they sent me to try, so I need to try them. So yeah, I have this sunblock from Japan, which I have to try. I still store it here like this because I don't want to open it. And I also have some Summer Friday masks. I also have the mini and the full versions. This one, I bought it when I traveled because this is amazing. This is such an amazing mask. And some several other things that I will show here because then we will stay here forever. But yeah, this is mainly my skincare makeup. I mean, my skincare um, drawer. This is pretty cool. There are other things that I store in the fridge light, as I mentioned, um, which I will show you later on. But yeah, this is the skincare drawer. Now we will proceed for this lipstick drawer. I do have a little bit of a mix here, but um, on here I got some of my favorite ones and some favorite brands as well as on the other drawer below is more of the all the lipsticks that maybe I don't reach as much as these ones. So I got here from Revlon, I also got from NARS, from Colourpop, from the Sailor Moon collection, some MAC lipsticks, some Pat McGrath ones. Some Dose of Colors and Necromancy, which is one of my favorite Puerto Rican makeup indie brands, which is cool. And I got some more MAC lipsticks over there. Some Urban Decay ones, which I have some from the Game of Thrones collections. Some Fenty, which, is, which they already have more than a year here, but yeah, I still collect them and they're there pretty in pretty good shape i have some fenty block glosses as well which are really pretty used and really good really good quality um and yeah those this is like the main lipstick drawer i reached to and i also got this lipstick from kk beauty which i love it kkw beauty <laughs> um some nyx as well here but i also got on the other drawer more NYX because I do receive some PR from them um, here locally in Puerto Rico which is pretty cool I have some of the powder puff lippies I do got some glosses some other colors that I don't reach for as much but I do use for special occasions such as Halloween or Christmas or you know any other thing that I come up with I do have here I do have some pharmacy some color pop here as well and some Maybelline ones that I don't reach for as much, but I do have like the whole collection, I think, because I did receive this PR package some years ago and I still have them um, because the, the packaging is really pretty and pretty aesthetic and the colors as well. So I have them there. On the other drawer, I have my face concealer base products. Um, I do have some powders as well which I will show you a little bit. Um, I do have my favorite current base, which is the Pretty Fresh ColourPop um, foundation. I don't know if this focuses over here, but yeah, this is the one that I'm pretty, mu pretty much using all the time. Um, I do have the No Filter Concealer. I also have the Concealer and Pretty Fresh and the Tinted Moisturizer, which I also enjoy. I do sometimes use the Pretty Fresh concealer, um, on, only that, and I will love it. I do have some setting sprays over here, and the most that I reach one it for is the Urban Decay All Nighter Pollution Protection Mist, which is amazing, and cold, a cold favorite. I do have some powders here. I do use this one for some Halloween looks, the All Nighter Urban Decay. The Chanel powder, which I love. This one has SPF as well. I do use it sometimes. Do use my Maybelline Fit Me Loose powder in 10. 
and I do have some primers, Hydro Grip Primer from Milk, and I also have this NYX Bear With Me Cannabis Sativa Primer, which is pretty cool as well. But I do tend to go for the Glossier one, which I will show you what's here because there are more makeup over here and stored and the most that I reach for on a daily basis. But yeah, this is the base products over here and some powders, which I love. Okay, so up next I have my eye makeup um, products. I do have the palettes down below, but that will be another video. So I will show you a little bit of my eye products. I do have some eyeliners over here. I got sent this Epic Wear liner sticks on a PR package, which is amazing. They are amazing, good quality. A lot of liners, mascaras. I do have a lot of NYX because of that. I do have a little bit of Urban Decay. And over here I got some liners, which are water water activated yeah the suva one the glam vice ones which are so cute these ones are some pastel ones that i bought recently this year i think i got some um radioactive by melolux uh, pigments some glitter and some more glitter from nyx i do have some lashes here this one i use them a lot this one is from a local brand as well make you make you which is from a makeup artist i know and she's the sweetest raisa i do have some more individual ones here and some tiny palettes like the pat mcgrath palette this one is the i ecstasy sublime eyeshadow palette and i also have some natasha denona mini palettes over here so I also got some eyeliner and lip liner sharpeners. This one is from NYX and then I have another one from, I think, L'Oreal. I think both were gifted, so that's pretty cool. And yeah, some also some other things I use to cut my eyelashes or yeah, these tiny scissors that they were there. Okay, so on my next drawer, I have a lot of palettes, paint palettes, eyeshadow palettes mainly, but these... I'm going to show you in another video because <laughs> these are a lot. I have a lot of things here, like, yeah. And probably I'm gonna organize them by um, brand and show you each of them. And yeah, I really love ColourPop, Natasha Denona, NYX palettes, um, also Urban Decay ones and Morphe ones, um, a little bit of many ones here too. So I'll try and show you each of them in another video. So stay tuned for that. I also have another drawer, I think it's this one. It has a lot of palettes, like literally, uh, these are the big ones, like the most big ones I own, so yeah, that's another video, guys. So this one over here, I have all my cheek products. Um, I do have from liquid to cream blushes and also obviously powder. I do love um, liquid ones I have from Cover F. I do have some cream ones from Maybelline. I do have some Glossier ones, but I'm gonna show you that that's on Again, I'm here like down below now, but there I have everything that's more Glossier um, I do store it apart because I do like to use some things apart and you know by brand, but Here I mainly have some Colourpop some MAC ones some Anastasia Beverly Hills highlighters as well as NYX ones. I do like this Kaja um, blush which is so cool. It has a heart stamp and you put it like that on your cheeks. I do have some glossy flesh ones like this flesh um, product. So cool. I love it. Um, but yeah, mainly I have all of my blushes stored like it is. I don't know if you guys want me to, you know, just do swatches or something. You can leave that comments down below. But my recent purchases here were the Sailor Moon blushes, which is so cute with the Lumina um, face over here. Oh god. Um, I also have the Wild Nothing collection blushes which is so cute from Colourpop as well I'm such a Colourpop fan like yep um, some Fenty highlighters and blushes as well as some miscellaneous blushes from different boxes I had um, from BoxyCharm 
I do have a lot of nicks as well as you may have <laughs> mentioned you know I may have heard that I do receive sometimes their packages so these are all my cheek products um, if you definitely want to see some swatches or some in-depth thing on the future I can do that um, but I definitely wanted to show you here where I store them and how but yeah I have a lot of different brands that I really like from Fenty to NARS to Colourpop to Maybelline to everything so yeah there is it and then the down in this drawer I have miscellaneous stuff like rhinestones some decor some makeup pouches some things that I store there just because because I don't have any other you know I don't have any other drawer so this one it's mainly you know all the cheek products all the lips skincare okay so moving on I do have other products over here some are from Glossier well mainly other Kiehl's sunscreens I do have a little bit of Chanel just to showcase that I have some of their products I do have the blush in bliss um, I think the mesmerize highlighter I do have her red signature lipstick the milk moisturizer which I adore and the Glossier priming moisturizer and the two sunscreens that I like which I love the beat shield actually but the Kiehl's super fluid daily UV is also good um, and the two Chanel lipsticks which I own yes I love it and yeah on here in this first drawer I do have a lot of skincare and mainly from Glossier I do. and on the second drawer I do have a lot of makeup from the brand and also from Rare Beauty I do have the liner over here which is so good I really really love that and I also have her brow product as well and yeah some random miscellaneous makeup from Glossier mascara the cloud paints which are my, some of my favorites I do have the little foundation over here the concealer and some eyeshadow products and yeah that is pretty much it all the things that i have of makeup <laughs> all over here as well so yeah thank you so much for watching this video it was hard for me to film because of all the noise outside but um i hope that you enjoy it and if you want like future swatches of the makeup or something you can let me know so see you guys on my next video bye